Hello, in this video I'm going to share how to use Alfred for Log6 Quick Capture. And as you see in this screen, so we are going to follow five steps. The first step is download Alfred workflow, then open the workflow from Alfred. And third step is specify a trigger and before we actually start using this workflow, you need to enable uh, this option from your browser in case you use Chromium based browser, the allow JavaScript from Apple events. I'm going to show you how to do that later. And the last step is open a website and use this workflow. So let's dive in. So for the to download this Alpha workflow, you need to go into this particular uh, you need to follow this link and I'm also going to share this link in the description section of this YouTube video. So if you click on this link, it will take you to this screen and just download this file. And once you, after you download the file, so this part is done and open the workflow from Alfred. And if you do that, you will see something like this, right? So the part is done. And the third part is to specify a trigger, right? And to do that, you can choose like, you know, any trigger you want. But for me, I'm going to use, I'm going to press a shift key twice, two times, right? So this is my trigger. So save. So after that let's go back to the steps and so we finished the third step and the fourth step is we need to enable this option to do that what you need to do is you need to go to your browser and go to view and under view there is this developer menu and you will find this allow JavaScript from Apple events option so make sure you enabled this option from your browser. So once that part is done, now we need to just open a website that we want to capture in Logosic. So I'm going to just open this one particular website and press the shift key twice, like this, that's it. Then you will see the information in your low sick. So let's try another site. For example, uh, let's try this edX website, right? And again, just press a uh, shift key twice. And you'll probably see uh, this pop up if this is the first web page that you're using for log six uh, quick capture then just check this check mark and open log six then you will find the information in log six once you're done once you check that check mark you can if you choose another page from the same domain it won't ask you it won't show you that uh, pop up again. So let me just try it one more time. Like, okay, great. Thank you for watching.